On the Mississippi River going after these guys walleyes again so what I'm using tonight is a husky jerk and there's that full moon right there oh I just got slammed and it pulled drag and everything All right, we are out on the Mississippi River going after these guys, walleyes, again. Full moon, that's why we came out. Full moon bite, but it's not actually as what we expected it to, to be. We believe in that full moon that really gets fish really active, but it got them active. Lots and lots of small ones, but this is only one of the few nice ones. Enjoy the video. All right, so this time around we're on the main channel Mississippi River under some really big highway bridges Going after walleyes on a full moon. We were hoping for the full moon to really get them active We, we, we really believe in that full moon, but it got a lot and a lot of small walleyes active and only so few good ones so we were using the husky jerk in some rocks and some weeds. The shore that we were fishing has all different types of weeds, rocks, sand. So a lot of small ones, only so few good ones. Enjoy the video. All right, the moon is on the other side of the bridge. It's a full moon, we're fishing full moon for walleyes. When it's full moon, I really do feel the full moon puts in a really hard work on getting these guys to bite during the night. It is a full moon night and we're out here going after walleyes and there's the first one. Let's keep it up. All right, it's not a keeper, but it's close. Well, that makes number two right under eater size again. So far, that full moon, just like I thought, has these walleyes chomp and we just need to find the bigger ones. All right, let me go to the back. All right, so what I'm using tonight is a husky jerk. I don't know if it's got a rattler in it or not, but you can hear something. Could be this the hooks rattling around. Eh, maybe that, I think it's got a rattle in it. Yeah, it's got a rattle in it. Because I was holding both hooks right there. A husky jerk with a rattler in there. Full moon. Full moon always helps. I really do believe in full moons. For getting stuff really active. We're on the main channel where we caught walleyes before. And we're here doing it again under a full moon. And there's that full moon right there. I caught them too and now it kind of got quiet. I don't know. But it's just not happening. Not tonight. Three small ones. Been out here for a couple, two, two hours or something I believe already. And that's it. I moved away from the bridge a little bit. There's a weed line right in front of me. I'm trying that. Just another small little dude, but at least we got we caught another one. Go back. There you go. All right. Let's see if we can catch a couple more along the weeds or I don't know. I'm thinking about moving to the other side and trying that. All right. We caught one that's staying down. Maybe this might be a keeper. I don't know. It's starting to look pretty small though again. Uh, maybe that one might be close I got a feeling it might not make it oh, I know you can't see it 
but it does mean it's right at 15. It is a 15 incher. All right. Well, I came back to the underneath the bridge. Caught a little sogger now. Tiny little guy. It's getting closer to that prime time hour. And I think that's what's going on. So these fish are starting to bite a little bit more. Oh, I just got slammed. And it pulled drag and everything. I just got slammed. Something's popping around out there. It slammed me, dude. Little walleye. Alright, another walleye. Little dude. In the weeds again. They are tonight seeming to be right right in these weeds in front of them weeds on the other side where it drops off after the weeds there's another walleye all right number seven i'm pretty sure this guy's too small but we'll still measure him just to make sure that makes seven walleyes one sogger starting to heat up i think the closer we get to morning here well there's another small little walleye it's gonna go back. Um, kind of a ways from the bridge now. Um, it's like you come. It's kind of like bass fishing. You hit the spot, you catch what's there, and then it's done. So the more I travel and look along or look around and stuff, it seems like certain spots have different fish and stuff. I don't know. I'm doing a lot of this, a lot of walking, a lot of moving to try to stay on fish kind of going back and forth but now i'm even going way further away from the bridge almost here's the wood line now well that is a sogger the black dots on the fin 13 inches so this one we're gonna keep that's our biggest sogger we got, our only keeper sogger. So a 15 inch walleye and a 13 inch sogger. Well, I thought I had another keeper, but it was only 14 inches. I am far, far away from the bridge now. I'm just walking the, the shoreline here, catching walleyes and soggers, mostly walleyes though. A lot and a lot of small ones and we need bigger ones. Full moon, but the big ones just ain't really hammering today or tonight. Alright, I got slammed out there. We got something on here. Felt nice at first. Looks small again. Another small dude. Right under 15, I'm pretty sure. Probably a 14 again. All right, we got something. Whacked it pretty good. Ah, they're all small, dude. Another small one that's just gonna be thrown back. All right, we got another one on. It looks like it's gonna be another small little dude. Yeah, too small, another little small walleye. All right, we got hammered. What the heck do I have? It's, I think it's a northern. What? It's a northern at night. Oh, okay, easy release right there. <laughs> a northern. You can see it's starting to get light. 
the other fish are starting to wake up and we're running out of time. So many little walleyes tonight. Well, I thought it would be a lot better because of that full moon. But, got some, couple nice ones, but. That little bit of light showed up and it's just like everything got quiet. Not, not a sign of nothing really at the moment. It just started getting light and then boom, just nothing. Daybreak and we're hooked into something. I almost kind of think it was a smallmouth at first because it, it surfaced, but now it's staying down. Um, I think that's another northern. Yeah, another northern. Oh. Probably our biggest one of today. Man, he just won't quit. I'm hoping he pops off, but... You done? Get you unhooked? Yeah, it's about the same size as that other one. And there he goes. Well, that is it from down on the Mississippi today, or tonight. As you can see, it's morning. Many, many, many small ones and barely any good ones. I got a couple good ones, but that's it. So many small ones. Full moon, I thought I was gonna be better. Kinda slow too, but they were biting somewhat. See y'all later.